Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Nick from Noob Hill coming at you with another Madden video today. So, if you guys haven't noticed, the Thanksgiving event has been out, and it's called the Ultimate Feast, and they have introduced five sets. So we got Smorgasbord, Buffet, all the trimmings, Thanksgiving, and the big one, Cornucopia. Um, unfortunately, I will not be taking a part in the Cornucopia set. I know a lot of you guys have been asking me to do it, but... Um, since all the downtime and it's I've been really busy it's been really hard for me to snipe the elite cards for it and if I if I can snipe it I'm only gonna have to buy it at the regular price and they do go from 60k to around 80k each and I need three per Thanksgiving set and then if you times three uh, times 80 or 75 times seven it comes out to 1.5 million so I do not believe I want to take that big of a hit. Um, I do apologize, guys, because um, if I took that big of a hit, I would be left with only like 500,000, and it'd be harder for me to make videos for you guys, and I always want to keep pumping out videos for you. So I do not want to take that big hit. And I know in this um, uh, Cornucopia set, you can pull uh, Barry Sanders, the legend, uh, 98 overall. And he goes for about four million, but I don't want to take the risk of pulling a Troy Aikman 94 overall uh, legend because that only goes for 1.5, uh, 100, 150k. Even though I get all those extra elites and a signature player, the signature player could also be a gold signature player, so I also don't want to take that big risk. And yeah, so if you do the math, it wouldn't really work out in our in my favor sometimes i could pull really lucky but i could pull unlucky so i don't want to take that risk i do apologize but yeah that's my decision and i want to just do that so though we did two sets already we did the buffet and the, all the trimmings now here we got smorgasbord this is this and cornucopia set are the only ones that are not repeatable that you cannot do more than once so this one will give you one the smorgasbord will give you one guaranteed thanksgiving player and the other ones are repeatable because it gives you gold players so here i got a thanksgiving player bradley robbie and he's a rookie and here's his stats if you guys want to pick him up i guess there's his stats for you guys but yeah so i will not be taking a part of the cornucopia again i do apologize uh, the, on the good news, I will be dropping a long-awaited Let's Build episode today. That will be epi episode 7. <laughs> Sorry about the stuttering. So, I haven't done, done one of those in a long time, but I will, I will be doing one of those. So, yeah. Also, I'm going to be doing the Thanksgiving dinner set just to show you guys what you guys can pull in it. So, yeah. Let's get into it. So here's the Thanksgiving. This one, you need three elite items. Like I told you, they are pretty pricey. I did pull one of them. I pulled the deep fried uh, turkey, but that one was the cheapest out of the three or the most common. So yeah, I did I did buy the other two. So I bought it just to make a video for you guys. So here we put the sweet potato, squash, and mashed potatoes. Now we put in the green beans, the ham, and pecan pie. And then the last gold item will be apple pie. And then for the elites, I'll put in the cranberry. And then the deep fried turkey. And before I put in the last one, I just want to show you guys what you guys have to do. You have to get 10 specific food items. You get one turducken food item, two gold or better players, two silver players, and two coin collectibles. And if you guys are wondering how you get the turducken for the cornucopia set, you will have to do this set prior to that. So you have to do this set seven times, guys. So this is the artwork for Thanksgiving dinner. And there's their Turducken Thanksgiving collectible item. And if you guys notice right there, you cannot sell this on the auction house. So there's that. Then we got two silvers, I believe. Or no, one silver. And we got 10K here. I believe that's 10K. And finally, we pulled Jamal Charles, guys. I pulled about 400 to 500K worth of packs. And I haven't been able to pull them. And I finally got them in the Thanksgiving pack. But there's their Turducken uh, collectible item. And yeah. So 
once you finish this, you have to do it seven times and you go to the cornucopia and that's where you get the items. So if anybody was wondering how you do the cornucopia set, this is how you do it. It's a bit pricey, but you could get a good outcome. And that's going to come to the end of the video, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Please hit that subscribe button, leave a like on this video, and I'll catch you guys soon. Peace.